BOSU balance trainer. I'm going to start with some um, cardio to get, every, get us warmed up. I'll get myself warmed up, and here goes. One minute intervals of each of these exercises. I'm going to start with right foot, left foot, right foot, left foot, running onto the BOSU. Ready, set, and go. Right, left. Keeping my core engaged, moving my arms for momentum. If you really, really want to make it harder, you can have high knees. When you come off of the BOSU, higher the better. I'm just kind of easing in right now. Core is engaged, I have a focal point. Focusing on my breath. Moving my arms for momentum. Breathing. I'm doing this, you can do this with shoes. I just felt, you know what, today, I'm not gonna wear shoes. Feels kind of good. Breathe through it. Also, because it's just a 15 minute video, you can always repeat it twice and have a pretty intense workout in 30 minutes. Okay, there's one minute. I'm going to give myself a five second rest. One, two, three, four, five, and now I'm gonna to go to left, right, left, right. So now I'm just changing out my feet. Still the arms for momentum. Core is engaged. I'm not dropping my chest. Keeping my shoulders back. I really like the Bosu. Balance trainer, it's great. I do a lot of personal training with it. When I'm teaching my daily classes, I don't use it, just because I don't have 20 of them, I don't have the space for 20. But personal training, I really, really like it. For, you know, for cardio, for balance. A lot of people are very timid about it. There's no reason to be, it just takes practice. Okay, there's a minute. Five second countdown. One, two. Right leg's gonna go on to the BOSU. Three, four, five. Arms are gonna be up, knee up, lunge. Right here, focal point. Now this, you're gonna slow up. So what you wanna try to do, right now my left foot, left foot, left leg is coming up but I want the placement to be down in the same place I left it, so it's balance. You can always hold a medicine ball and do this. My right foot, never put the um, weight into your knee. Your, my foot is angled like this down onto the BOSU, so it never goes into the knee. I'm actually taking my elbows and doing a little kickboxing with my elbows. Like if someone was in back of me, they would get it with my elbows, boy. Core is engaged, focal point. Focusing on my breath, looking at my focal point. There's a minute, five second. Five second, catch my breath. Left foot's gonna go on the bow soon now. One, two, three, four, five, go. You'll always have a part, side of your body that has better balance. Ooh, yikes. Core is engaged. As you can see, this side's harder. So I might not do as much talking out of focus. Remember, flat back, chest up. looking down for a focal point. I'm really not looking down, down, I'm looking like out, down. My left, my left quad is very isolated, so I'm feeling a burn in that. There's a minute, okay, now we're gonna do squat-ons, squat-offs. 
So we're gonna start on the ground. Five second rest. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna squat on and then I'm gonna squat off. Squat on, squat off. You don't have to go as deep as me on the squat on. Do what makes sense. Squat on, squat off. Squat on, squat off. Squat on, squat off. Squat on. Kills the quads. Keep the chest up. Slow up your pace. If your legs are on fire, it's okay. 10 seconds. And here's a minute. Oh, the quads. Stretch it out. Okay, I'm gonna turn it upside down. I'm gonna get on the floor now. I'm gonna hold plank for, for one minute. If you have sore, you know, weak wrists, you can always put a towel down. I'm gonna show you what that looks like. It's gonna look like this. The biggest thing about Bosu is when you do plank on it, you wanna have it balanced and as still as you possibly can. I'm gonna go on my hands and do wide-legged hand plank for one minute. Try to keep this stable. Okay, here we go. Looking straight down. Engaging in my core, focusing on my breath. One minute. So if, my, if the blue part of the BOSU is tilting forward or tilting towards me, it's not balanced. You gotta really focus on keeping it balanced and trying not to have it move. close I'm sure I can always tell by the way my body feels how close I'm getting to the minute there it goes okay stretch back now you can do this on elbows also we're gonna I'm gonna do it on hands I'm gonna have start with plank feet together this time and I'm gonna do knee knee opposite knee no it's gonna be left knee to right knee left knee right knee to right knee okay one minute ready and go. Feet are together once again, keeping it balanced. So now I've got movement going on. It's gonna be a little more challenging, but I can do it. And if one minute is too long, listen to your body and do what feels right for you. Really engaging in my core, keeping my hips up, Keeping my butt not up in the air, keeping it down, but not hips down too much or puts pressure on my lower back. <sighs> Breathing is very important. Focus on the breath. Stretch the arms. Now I'm gonna do some mountain climbers with five push-ups in each round for a minute. So, 10 mountain climbers, five push-ups. We'll see how, how this goes for one minute. So I'm gonna get back up on the BOSU and do my best to keep it uh, level. Okay, 10 mountain climbers, five push-ups for one minute. Ready and go. Eight, nine, ten. I'm gonna go wide. One, two, three, four, five. Feet together. One, two, six, seven, eight, 
10, lift wide, find more push-ups. There's <sighs> five, 10 more mountain climbers, feet together. You see it's kind of tilting. I'm getting sweaty in my hands. Sometimes it's good to we'll work up gloves. Two, three, four, five. There's a minute. Stretch my arms. Now we're gonna do some burpees without a push-up with the BOSU. Start wide-legged. Let me show you one. It's gonna be here, half up. You're gonna do five of these going out, staying in squat. One minute, no push up. Okay. All right, stay wide, start wide plank, hop up to the BOSU. <clears throat> stay in squat and go out five times. BOSU, bring it down and repeat it until a minute's up. Ready? And go. Wide leg, hop, stay in squat, weight in my heels. One, two, three, four. Five, bring it down, back. Let's hold plank for about a second or two. Wide leg, one, two, three, four, five. Bring the bosu down, pause. One, two, hop back up, breathe. One, two, three, four, five, Daytime shoulders. One, two, hop up, stay in squat. One, two, three, four, uh, five. Very hard. One, two, hop up. There's a minute. Okay. So I did those not too fast. You probably could get another one, two, three, four, five up. Okay, now. Now I'm going to do a burpee, no push-up. Instead of going out, I'm going to raise it up this way for five. Okay. Start wide. Okay, ready? Wide legs. Hop up. One. My head is actually hitting the bosu. Three or four, five. This is easier, but it's still really good. Pause. One, two. Hop up. Slight bend in my knees. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, great upper back. One, two, hop up. Core is engaged. One, two, three, four, five. Bring it down. Don't forget your pause right here. One, two, hop up. One, Two, three, four, five, bring it down. One, two, hop up, bring it up. One, two, I just minute which it went off. Four, I just want to finish this round. And five. Okay, now turn it around, turn it upside down, or actually right side up. Balance, not let my heart rate getting up there. We're gonna um, work on some balance move. So I'm gonna start with <laughs> standing on the BOSU. You can hold a medicine ball or it's just your body, depending on what you want. I'm gonna actually just use body weight for right now. So focal point, high knees with control. I'm actually gonna, I should set my timer. I'm gonna try this for a minute. Good luck to me. When I bring that leg up, my core is very engaged. Breathe. Breathe to self. And actually,
focus, breathing. Cool. Legs are getting heavy. Okay, so now I'm gonna do a side lunge. Straight leg, do not put the weight into the knee, do not move the kneecap out. This is what it's gonna look like, pushing off the bent knee, and I'm gonna come up like this for balance. Okay, one minute, this side, the other side, one minute. All right, here goes. I really focus on this, it's tricky. I like to have my arms up in the air on the balance. Arms here, focusing on my breath. Once again, still as a statue, arm right up. Core is very engaged. Slight bend on my knee, left knee that's on the bow, so you don't lock it. There's a minute. Now, other side, five second count on one, two, three, four, five. Now, whoops. By the way, Bosu, you can order them on Amazon. Um, Sporting Goods store has them, I know. They're about 120 bucks, depending. I haven't purchased one in a, 10 years, but I think that's what they're up to. Somewhere in there. It's a great thing to have at the house. It's good for your children, if they're athletes, to get on this thing. For any sport that they play. And if I'm 46 years old and can do this, okay, there's a minute. All right, now, I wanna show you one thing you can do because I'm running out of time. I've got 10 pound dumbbells, and I'm gonna do a, uh, just standing on the BOSU. I'm gonna do one minute of work, doing upper body work. So, just gonna do shoulders. Very, very still. It's amazing just having to focus on my, on my uh, balance, how much harder this is um, than just standing on the floor. Breathe, engage in that core, smile if you want to, focus. Oh. Do not put the weight. Oh. Still as a statue. Mm. Breathing out. Oh my, there's a minute. Okay, so obviously you can do show. I just did show I just did uh shoulder presses. You can do every muscle group standing on it. I want to do one more thing, and I'm just gonna do it on one side. I'm gonna do a side plank hold on the BOSU. So this is kind of always fun. So one minute, I'm just gonna do it on my right arm, but repeat it onto your left arm. So, uh, elbow, I like my forearm to be in the center of the BOSU. And then here's your hold. You can always lift your leg up. But what's nice about this is once again, I gotta fix my elbow because it's slipping. The thing is you get pretty sweaty. So I have a towel on hand to, um, so you don't slip your arm off the BOSU. Anyway, please subscribe to 
Amy's Beach Fitness on YouTube. I'm all about making a difference in people's lives. Huge passion for fitness. And uh, keep self-caring. It's very, very important. This is tricky. I mean, it's a lot harder than on the floor. You can always drop to me. This would be a modification just to say you can do that. Okay, and there's a minute. So anyway, um, oh, wow, am I sweating? Subscribe to Amy's Beach Fitness on YouTube for the trillionth time. And um, take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye.